If you're like me and you just accepted another firmware update on the Elegoo Centauri Carbon, then what you need to do first thing before you try to print anything else is come down here to the calibration, do the one click self check. We're going to select all and we're going to do everything. Um, hopefully the remote control of the bed temperature will work from the Elegoo slicer again because I like to manually, when it resets the bed temperature to 60 degrees, I'm gonna knock it down to like 25 or 30 because that is where I run it with the cold plate, the cold build plate on. So we're gonna go ahead and run that and um, hopefully everything is good with this new version of the firmware. That'll be exciting. There were some a little, little annoying things I was waiting for them to fix, like being able to to manipulate things from the slicer, like turn the light on or off or change the nozzle temperature or the bed temperature. So having those fixed will be a big deal for me. So keep your fingers crossed. Do you think it's gonna work? I'll let you know in another video. You have to subscribe if you wanna see that.